Hi, my name is Rahasia, and as you know, my wife and I, we published the Lotus Guide magazine, and we've always had a concentration and a focus on health. And this is why we decided to publish an article this next time about chemtrails. Now, I don't know how many of you know about chemtrails, but I can tell you that there's quite a few people in the community that think it's a hoax still. Because when you go and you Google it, a lot of things come up about a hoax. But when you check out the information, really check it out, it makes no sense at all in the light of all the information that's out there and the fact that there are several government agencies that say that they are indeed spraying us with aluminum oxide. So we know it's true. What we don't know is why. And before we go any further, I'd like to just show you a few pictures. And some of these pictures were taken in and around Chico. But a lot of this is going on from Mount Shasta all the way down to Sacramento. And it's a global event. Other countries seem to know quite a bit about this. It's only our country that seems to be a little bit in the dark. So check out these pictures and I'll get right back to you. Now, after looking at those photos, I am sure you have questions, and this is why we wrote the article. And remember, when you look up in the sky and you see chemtrails, not contrails, chemtrails, a lot of people say those are condensation trails, but if they were, what does this mean on a clear day? Did they stop all the national and international flights? I don't think so. So remember, it's only by being a well-informed citizen that you can take appropriate action. I've, imposed, I've posted this entire page on what to do and the steps you can take on who to get a hold of, your representatives in Congress and the Senate, and there are even petitions you can sign with websites dedicated to this situation. So I encourage you to go to www.lotusguide.com, read my article, you know, before you start emailing me about this. Remember, we live on a wonderful planet and we should do everything in our power to keep it clean. But this doesn't happen by ignoring the obvious facts and hoping they will go away. So it's up to all of us. So go to www.lotusguide.com and check this out for yourselves and I'll show you a few more photos here and uh, remember we're part of the people that we've been waiting for. <laughs> 